Hi, Collective. Hey, you guys. How are you? Hope y'all doing good today. I'll pull this out. I was trying to see what the energy was, and... <coughs> So I'm pulled out the energy of scales are being balanced, collective, whatever somebody does, is doing to you all or whatever it is, the scales are being balanced. Okay, so it says, um, if you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome to Pam Star Oracle. I'm Pam, nice to meet you, and hopefully I can give y'all something today from all the lessons I've learned in my life. Um, I have a lot of this in me. I'm an Aquarius, but I have four, five Libras, four, four or five Libras in me. So that means I'm the bringer of justice, okay? Because if you look at uh, in a tarot deck, justice is number 11. I'm an Aquarius, number 11. And justice card is number 11, okay? <coughs> All right, so... I'm made to do this. People that's trying to say that I'm not in a spiritual community because I know this one or two readers in general, three, I know three all together, and I'm just going to shut up, but they don't like me. One in particular really don't, but uh, she didn't understand that I'm the one supposed to make her shut her lip, you know, and I'm just going to shut up because spirit will reveal exactly what she does. That's why they're mad. We're not going to take it anymore. Nah. Y'all can't say I'm this and that and blotty blotty. And all this bullshit is going to be slingshotted right back between your all's eyes. And I'm the one that said that. Slingshot. You know, I made that card. You know, now they're like, it's going to be slingshotted back. The bitch says I copy. No, you can copy everything I say. You're not. This woman says she's a part of 144,000, you all. And I love y'all collective. And yeah, I cuss. And I get mad because these people, they they lie. They say they're a part of something like that. But yet the same said person never um, uh, doesn't believe in God. She's a narcissist. I mean, uh, if you think you're a God, you're a narcissist. I don't really care who you are because I have enough common sense. And I don't have a brain malfunction i don't have a malfunction in my brain um and yeah i mean i I'm, I'm a true born star i'm an aquarius you know and all these jerks uh that comes that all uh all this shit's gonna get slingshotted right back to anyone that comes off as a jerk to a true born star who has only ever tried to be of help and shows love to all that you come across which is me this is me this is my card you all i love y'all collective i tell y'all all the time i do but it's funny that they'll sit and put put you down and steal from my collective. And I know who it was. I know who the reader was. And y'all do too, collective. And that's when my channel started slowing down and messing up. So let's go back. Let's rewind back a month ago. Uh, my channel, you all, you all know it was collective. It was going zoom, zoom. I got a bunch of uh, subscribers. How do you think it happened? Because, you know, I got in the system and now it's somehow like uh, I, I'm not getting around and I done told y'all about that. It's okay. Um, yeah, I hit, hit raise two. It, at one woman, at, you you sent me a message yesterday uh, and, and, you know, I, I heard what you said. and uh, But um, when I had did that video, I had only looked at them two videos. When I went and looked back on my whole page... And I had looked at day four at you all, and I didn't have no subscribers new on it. Are you listening? Then when I went back and checked, then I seen I had 10, y'all, 10. And it didn't post it. So that right there, I'll tell you. And they're mad. They're mad that I'm a true born star. And I think that that reader, that's a, a B-I-T-C-H. She don't like you spelling cuss words well. Just keep on cussing and... And putting other readers down, you stupid ass reader, because you're the main narcissist and everybody knows. And you got your little demons. Your demons is running amongst on earth. And and uh, you little alp that you stole from my collective, you know she did. You know she did, don't you, Kenny? You know she did. 
And uh, that's this is what I am, what they don't understand. So uh, they think they can get away with it. And I'm not jealous of nobody. I am not. That bitch, would, that bitch is jealous of me. See, I'll cuss. I don't care. I don't have to spell it. I'll just say it, you know, because... If uh my if we'd have had the money in my family, I would have been a lawyer. Yeah, motherfucker. If you go look at my birth chart, I just told you what I was in it. If my family would have had money, um, this would be a totally different situation. Had I not gotten touched at ten year old, and I didn't get touched by somebody that was an older man or something, y'all know it was somebody in my fucking family around my age, and and it happened for a long time, and. The thing is, that's why I quit school. That's why I quit school um, in 12th grade. I only had three months left. And um, I just fucked off and did whatever I wanted to. And I, got, I was into drugs and shit. And I was a motherfucking honor student. Are you listening? I was an honor student. I asked my mom with straight A's. When the teacher would leave in third grade, you all, you know what she'd say? Pam's the teacher. So here I'd go teach. And, you know, and I'd be like, no, that ain't how you do that. People that didn't know how to read, I taught them. I told him how to read you all, and I'm not lying. And this woman uh, on her uh, app the other day, what it said is, it was saying, uh, known a, it's known around and about the town. Remember her app that she used that she stole from over here all me? Now, she'll come and talk about me and how shitty and about my paragraphs and shit, and the dumb bitch needs to listen to the whole story. So let me tell you, dumb bitch, all right? Uh, what was I going to say? So her little app, it said, uh, what was I trying to say? Known about town. And it said, uh, Pam and Clip. See, uh, right around that time, and it said Chosen One. It pulled out Chosen One on what she wrote over our right time. It said my name, Pam. It said Chosen One. And, 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 and that dumb bitch said that I had did fucking uh, spells on my children, you lying whore. You hate me because I raised my kids. That's the difference between me and you. You want to get mean? You want to get big? Well, let's get big. You're mad at me because I'm married. You're mad at me because I raised my children. You're mad at me because my children love me. That's all it is, okay? You're the bringer of justice. You're the bringer of fucking destruction. That's what you are. And all these people that praises you, they're just... I hate to tell you, but they're all they're all addicts, dumbass. You're not you're not that like you think that you are. You gotta you, you need to knock your narcissist down a little bit, but you can't. The only thing you can do now, some bitches, is knock them upside the head with a fucking piece of wood. Something real. So, that's the only way you can. That's the only way you can hurt them, y'all. You had to fucking hit them with something, you know. And if she come over here, I'd hit her right upside the head, but she doesn't have enough balls. All she knows how to do is jerking. Chicka, 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 jerky off at the mouth that's all you know how to do woman that's that's what you're known for in the town and uh i mean y'all you can sit over and say this and that and the other you know what i mean but i know what's real and i know i'm not no fucking liar or no fake and i love everybody and i know that all of us in this tarot land we learn shit from others but i also know one thing you don't come and deliberately steal and then you fucking say like a fucking witch and cackle you said that uh yeah, <laughs> I'll just keep on coming over here, and I'll steal your content. I'll take your content. That's what you said. So, <laughs> if you all watch that girl, it starts with a P, and she wears glasses, and she she back and forth, back and forth. She's a narcissist. She'll try to make you laugh and be on her good graces. After she's uh, put you down and, and said death was coming in and you're dying of colon cancer and you did magic on your kids. And this bitch is mad because, here, bitch, let me tell you another thing. You told me you had four children. Why the fuck do you only talk about one of them? You've had four live births. I'm not talking about the ones that you uh, aborted. I'm not talking about that. I'm not, I'm not putting you down. I don't give a fuck what you did. I'm telling you what the fuck you did to me, motherfucker. That's where we got to. And you can sit there and say, I didn't say nothing about that, reader. Blah, blah, blah. Motherfucker, you made it personal. When you said, let me get my pendulum, I'm going to say something personal. And I know it was about me. Because you know it. I got pissed off. And I said, I was getting tired of being told all this shit. And you was pointing it right to me. Go ahead and have enough courage to spit it out of your lips, sir. Go ahead and spit out my name. Spit it out. You're a coward. You're a coward. You're a coward. I've said your name on my fucking channel. You're not. I will not say your name again. My collective knows exactly who you are. 
So uh, this is coming out. All that bullying, you all. I'm sorry, Collective. I have to do it because uh, they, but she, she and her devil minions, her demons that she let run amongst on the fucking earth because a bitch needs to go buy some sage. She don't never show yet. No, nah, she don't believe in cleaning. She, no, she don't believe in cleaning with sage. Uh -uh. No, that's why she likes to live at them fucking places because a maid can come in there and clean the motherfucking room. Are you listening? That's why. Yeah, and she'll be like, I, I read it by the month. I don't give a fuck. You're the type that say, go in there and clean. You don't do it yourself. I don't give a fuck. I know. See? How's it feel to be bullied? How's it feel to be bullied, Peely? How's it feel? All right. I know how to bully them bullies back, okay? And that's why narcissists get mad when you tell everything, when you tell all their secrets. She got mad because I told the fucking truth. She was in on some shit, and I did that one reading, and she got mad. And I was trying to warn her, hey, you might order to move out of that place because these people know that you're in there and that, you're, that you fucking ratted and you was around something that had took place. That's why she's mad. That's why she got mad totally, you all. And that's why she stole your stuff, Kenny. Just letting you know. All right, I love y'all. Because it's true and she knows I'm true. And she go around saying, I'm fake, motherfucker. Lemon, lemon, twin flame, I love you. Oh, God, I fuck you in my bed every night. That's what pisses her off, okay? She's mad because she ain't with her. She's like, my dude, he's a good, yeah, but... You know, it ain't her twin, because if it was, a motherfucker would say it, she, I, and I've never heard her say it. She's like, my dude's good, yeah. You're all good enough. If you're if you're good, and both of you are working, why don't you move your ass out of that place? No, let's be honest about this. Don't say, well, don't you think about, don't you worry about where I'm living. Well, let me fucking tell you. I'll tell you right now, if I had people fucking gawking and stalking at me all the time, I wouldn't want to live at that place. If they was fucking shit overflowing and everything, I wouldn't want to live there. The only reason you live there is because on the weekends, that's why you don't do readings, because you're doing meth. All right, I had to put it out to the collective, y'all. That's true. Who do you think? Think about that. Why Why ain't she doing readings on the weekend? Uh, my old man's here. How many how many times do I upload on a weekend, my collective? I love y'all. And how many times I say, honey, honey, do you ever hear, hear, hear her do that? Nah. Nah, she don't ever do readings around her old dude. But see, she can sit and god dang bash me and my people all she wants to, collective. But I'll tell you right now, she's getting ready to go down. There, and, and it done said somebody's coming to uh, hurt you at the hotel. That was for you. That was a personal reading for you because that's your karma. It's going to happen there, so you can keep living there and saying you didn't get warned. But I warned her, Collective, and I love y'all. And I know that she did this to another reader, uh, a cancer reader that's uh, out in California. And she's mad at her because that cancer didn't want nothing to do with her. She didn't pay no mind to her, and it pissed her off. It pissed her off because somebody else has knowledge, and she loves to steal your knowledge and steal all your things. Yeah, that's all it is. And now I told on you, smirky, smelly. All you're getting is fucking uh, addicts. You're, you're, so you need to do a little more drug talking and counseling and tell them get on some boxing like I tell my collective motherfucker. Why don't you do that? No, because... You're like, no, I'm against, you ain't fucking against it. That's why you and your man fucking don't come on on the weekends. I, and I knew it. I knew this five months ago. I knew this five months ago because I asked my pendulum. My pendulum don't lie. No, nope, it don't lie. So I know you're, I know you did it five fucking months ago. You want me to do it in front of the collective right now and ask? All right, here, collective. Let's do it. She think I don't have a heavy necklace. Spirit. <laughs> only honest answers. Only honest answers. Um, uh, this reader that it personally attacks me, and uh, thank you, son, and I appreciate you so much. Does this reader still do meth to this day, and she's lying to the collective because she thought it was funny to do this on chosen ones? Okay, and she thinks I'm not one. And I, I told y'all I was a chosen one a long time ago. I was part of hundred forty four thousand months and months ago. You know, this is my story. I've linked it in the Bible, and I'm not showing that bitch where I linked it exactly to because it's nobody's business. But anyway, spirit guides, only honest answers. Uh, is this uh, woman still doing meth to this day? Because she was five months ago. Is she still doing meth to this day? Oh, yes. Look, back, forth, back, yes. Okay, could you clear that? Okay, they're clearing it. Is this woman uh, a demon? Yes, yes, yes. See, it didn't lie. Is this is this reader's name uh, start with a P and she lives at the motel? 
Only honest answers, Spirit. Hang on. Spirit, is this woman's name start with a P and she lives at the motel? Uh, a demon? Honest answer. Honest answer. Honest answer. Now, do y'all believe the pendulums? And do you, who do you believe? So, I mean, that's what that's how she makes you all believe. That's how she makes her collective believe. Are you listening? So, it's true. It's true what I said. It's true what I said. Look, 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 look. Can I help people? Uh, can I help addicts spirit because I know about Sabox? And am I telling the truth and I don't lie to my collective? I told y'all we've... That I've been that I know about Suboxone for thirteen or fourteen years now. Is it true, collective? Show the collective that that's what I do, please. See it? Yes, yes, I'm on it. See, I don't lie. That bitch lies. Now, who do y'all believe? Meth? Do y'all believe meth head or a prescription from a doctor to where you don't go seeking it? See, I told them to go get on it. If they can afford to. Uh, Live at a place like that and buy drugs. You can afford to be on some boxing, all right, y'all? And if your old man's good, he probably has good insurance, and you could get it for a hell of a lot cheaper. So, I mean, that's on your all. So, Collective, I'm sorry I had to do that. Okay, but we're not going to take it anymore. We're not going to take it anymore. All they know how to do is be a passive-aggressive bully gambler. And all those smiles and smirks, they don't work over here. No, they don't work over here. See, my pendulum, it never lies. It never lies. See that? And I told y'all to learn how to use more discernment than that. Didn't I, Collective? I told you. I said, now, y'all can believe that if you want to, but you got to use a little more discernment. But that's true, because I've done used discernment. I done had a vision about it, Collective, and I know I did. And I don't put out my visions. No, I'm not dumb. And was written long ago to take them all down and put them where they belong. This is what I'm supposed to do, and I always shit out for you. And uh, all this bullshit's get slingshot back, because... She's been the one working with the karmic men. Yeah, they pay her. These karmic men, us good women, uh, tarot readers, that's here to help a lots and lots of people. She's working with that karmic man, <laughs> and um, that's why their boat won't go down. And uh, you, uh, she, they, the karmic pays them to do his, their shit magic. Seventeen, seventeen, it's shitty, and that means eighty eight's coming to me, and we're gonna be abundant collective because I'm gonna give back to you always. That bitch won't give you a shirt off her back. She's a narcissist. You want them to see all the hard work that you've done and the changes made. Yeah, no, this, this they're not wanting people to see all the changes you made. That's why they got paid so it wouldn't. And they're drowning in their emotions, uh, for you need to speak up, like, drowning, they're drowning in their emotions for you, and they need to speak up to you and be honest with you, but she and he, this karmic, they don't know how to do that. They're negative narcissists. I'm sorry, you guys, I love y'all, and I am trying to help the collective, y'all know I am. And uh, I'm tired of this shit, and tomorrow this motherfucking shit ain't coming out, because if it does, I'm just gonna sage it and clear it, okay? All right, and you don't need another person to make you feel good about yourself. Heal your heal your heart and love yourself. This is what I'm telling her because she proclaims to be so happy, but they're still doing that shit behind closed doors. 18, 18, 99. And I'm telling the truth, and that's about uh, con uh, uh, completing a cycle, nines. So uh, you need to c do that ending, our girl, and, and quit telling everybody else how to do it. And you never, and you need to fucking do it because you all are still doing that shit on the weekends. Oh, and Libra, you represent love, peace, and harmony. You're very romantic, and you see the beauty in all things. Hey, did you hear that? Yeah. <laughs> see, I ain't no dumb dumb. I didn't say your full name. See, I ain't no dumb dumb. See, she treats. She tells you her all, all these secrets. I ain't no dumb dumb. I didn't tell your whole name. <laughs> so what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? This is what you get. This is all you're going to do is is get is get an ice chewing. That's it. That's it. You you're ta you was over talking about that one reader, and she's got an autistic son, and you was let, saying that she is a whore and all this shit. You're going to go to hell. You're going to go to hell. 1919, real soon. Why do you think I keep seeing all them fucking numbers? Why do you think I keep seeing all them? Because it's true what I'm saying about her. I love y'all, collective. I'm done. I'm done. She did. This person didn't know that uh, I am their karma. They're gonna be drowning. They're gonna be drowning and dead. That's what's gonna happen. And, and they did it to themselves. 
they did it to their self because the law's coming to kick your door in. Because that's what y'all do on the weekend. Y'all don't y'all just don't write messages because you live right there where it's at so you can buy it easily on hand. That's all you do. That's all you do. I mean, I mean it that's why you can't leave. That's why you can't leave. <laughs> Sorry, Collect. She loves to put everybody down. I had to put her in her place. And I love you guys. And I appreciate you all because, yeah, I, like I said, I got all this in my chart. I've been honest to y'all about it. And this bitch don't know how to be. See, I'm honest. That's why they hate me. They know I'm true and that I bring out the truth. I don't care. I tell what my old man's done to me. I don't give a fuck. I told y'all. I told y'all I got molested and incested. And they think it's funny. And, uh, well, they're going to see the funny justice of doing this to a real chosen one. And then, and then she'll preach about the Bible collective. It's funny when she preaches about the Bible, ain't it, collective? And, and she's against God. and um, But she's a part of the 144,000. Why? Well, how can you do that? How can you do that, woman? Because that's dumb. You're, you're, you're all right with if it sounds good. That, that's a narcissist. But if it sounds bad, you're against it. So you don't like the part that, uh, you know, you got to repent. She don't like that part. That's all you got to do to know God. And, and she's never done it. She's never done it, y'all. That's why I'm on here preaching about it. Because I'm tired of how she's doing in, 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 in uh, the collective at the moment. I'm tired of it. And, and, that's, and my work ain't getting around because that bitch has come over here and took all kinds of shit from me. But there's a bunch of them having. It's all right. I, I'm not bitching about that. I'm bitching about how she treats people. 2122. You need to learn to stop treating people the way you do and acting like um, you 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 hate God and that's a fake and all this. I'm telling you right now, yeah, you, no, you, you I would never be in your cult. You're you're trying to start a cult. Are you gonna make them drink the Kool Aid? Cause you're wanting to write a new Bible. You said now who gives you that authority? Whoa, yeah, I don't think it. I think people understands that you let out demons on the earth. Cause I was true about that, you all. I, I do the occult tarot. She does demons. Are you listening? That puts demons on the earth. She don't like that I did that that occult because it's for the it's for rich people. Do you understand? That's why. She don't. That's why she don't like it. It pissed her off when I used it. But she's a demon. She needs a demon all just to uh, cleanse her soul is what it is. <laughs> And I love y'all, and let's see what else it wants to say. Let me do one of this. Look, lot lizards. You know, them's all laying around them hotels and motels. You know they are. They're laying around everywhere. I didn't say that you're one. I said they're laying around our everywhere. Why do you want to live with that? Don't say because of money. Hell, money's tight. But hell, all you got to do is move uh, move somewhere else and uh, somewhere else, in, uh, like in the country part, not be right in the city. But you love that shit. You thrive in it because you want to be right there at it. Because you're this. You're in a codependent relationship. She tells everybody else about these codependent relationships. And that's what she is. She's in it. She's not going to say anything to me about being codependent, bitch. Because I've been married for 22 years. What are you doing? Your dude, your b boyfriend. Well, I mean, you're shacking up. That's why you're against the Bible. You believe in fucking before you're married. You you never did cut off sex. That's stupid. And people that believe her, you're stupid. Because she's a damn demon. And I'm telling you right now, she is a demon devil running amongst on earth. She is. She is, you all. So keep on watching her and y'all going to see because this is what's coming for her. This is hellfire and brimstone. That's what's coming to her. Oh, at Halloween. At Halloween because uh, this dude woman wanted to ride your coattails, but they ain't got no gumption. She wants to ride everybody's coattails and and uh, put everybody else down and uh, steal from you. And the bitch knows she stole from over here, bitch. I could have shut that shit down a long time ago, your stupid little fucking app. And she like, but, but I didn't steal that from you. Yeah, you did, motherfucker. Because as soon as I mentioned it, you did it. So I wonder where you got the great idea. You think I'm stupid? You're fucking stupid and you look stupid. So say it again about a chosen one. You're going to hell in a handbasket, and I'm going to be there 
fucking to help judge. I don't give a fuck. If I was to die right now, I'm good with myself because I've repented. And you're mad at me because I can tell my secrets. Oh, and she can't collect it. That's how it is. That's how it is collected. These people are stupid, you know? Yep, they are. They are sometimes. Can we change the energy, please? <clears throat> Having children is in somebody's destiny out here. The divine knows your heart is pure and love and, and nurturing. And you have a little spirit baby floating around. You got a little spirit baby. I love you guys. I'm glad of that. That ain't me, you all. My spirit baby would be uh, this business. And if, you, if you've lived with a person for many years, 25, 25, oh, 25, that's my birthday. Uh, when you've lived with people for many years, you get to learn their patterns and their fears. And in the bedroom, you'll orgasm a plenty. And through all the fighting and conflict, you've learned a many lessons because you figured out to remember to always count your blessings. That's by me, Pound Star Oracle. Yeah. Yeah. And, and it was for me to have the children I have and love them and raise them and be honest with them the whole time growing up about drugs and what it does. And I was with my, ki uh, with my kids, you all, and they don't do them. And I thank God and I thank you for it, Spirit. And these people that lust to challenge God and they've never lost a kid to death by... And it being like 17 or 2 or 10. Now, she might have took her own kid's life. Well, that's why she's feeling guilt. See, I felt guilt because I wasn't there when he put a gun to his head and pulled the trigger. So, you went and did it intentionally. That's that's good that you did that. And, and, and what about that? I mean, what I would have chose to done is get on some birth control since you was old enough to know better and keep taking it. But, I mean, some people are lazy. Some people are lazy. And, you know, uh, and my kids know I was meant to, uh, you know, be a, be a mom. That's what I'm meant to do. And Divine Masculine said, he don't care what people says about you, about you all. He's well aware of all the jealousy from these haters. And he knows you are his Divine Feminine. Even if you're a year or two older or if you're five or six years younger than him. He said, let us say you're a cougar or let us say I'm going after a young one. Uh, you're worthy of love and the prettiest woman to him. That's all that it means, okay? And I'm with mine. I love my divine last client. He's so good to me, you all, and I do love him. And they're trying to make you out to be a bad guy like they forgot all the hell that they brought, tried to bring into your life was all out of envy and jealousy and not wanting you to keep moving towards your goals and dreams. But, you know, we learned to leave these toxic bunch in the dust. That's what they're mad about, these toxic women that I was talking about, narcissists. We don't look back. And me and my divine masculine don't. Ha <laughs> ha, we don't. Oh, and the planets are aligning to bring you twins together so you guys and gals can become a unified unit and be as one. See, God did it. See, that's why they don't believe it. That's why they don't believe in uh, God because it ain't nothing good aligns like that for them. Somebody is hoping and praying that you will let them back in your good graces and let them prove to you that they've changed to be the person that you that uh, you and everybody else needs them to be. Uh, as, as, as these people, as this uh, people, as per, this woman that makes you out to be a bad bad guy to everybody. And I don't do it collective until I know for a fact that they've said it to me and for me. Because that reading, it was two weeks ago, y'all. You need to go look it up. I can't remember the name of it. But I got a card in here I made where it tells all that information. And uh, But it's, it was two weeks ago, and it was something. Uh, just go back two weeks and look at her readings until you see it. It's towards the end. It says my name in it. On an app, okay? That she stole from my collective. Because she knows that me and that girl was uh, getting ready to partner up and do it, and a fucking bitch did that. Yeah, I, me, me, and, uh, me and you, Kenny, remember, we was going to do that, wasn't we, Kenny? Yeah, and she kind of stole it, because that's what she is. She's a she's a trickery, dickery doc, and then acts like, and then acts like you do something bad. And then she, and then she does, uh, she did, uh, 
questions on a chosen one. And see, I knew you wasn't chosen. That's why I did that on you. Yeah, people are uh, connected to you and your channel, but I just told why. Because they're demons and they're running to you because they know you do that on your channel. And someone is getting exactly what God wanted you to have because you had faith in his time and, and you're a part of his 144,000. And what they, what they don't understand is they can sit and buy shit all they want to, but they can't be a part of that. They can't even pretend to be in that because they, they, don't, they don't love God. They don't. Uh -uh, they don't. That's why that's why the 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 planets are aligned to keep you all twins together. See, uh huh. That's why. Oh, and what else? And what else? Upgrades are coming because I spoke the truth today. Look, after you speak your truths to the people who was stopping you, and they was trying to stop me, collective, because they've been. They was the ones that latched on my channel. I done told you. Oh, and there was another girl that was like, Oh, I wish you would put clips to your videos. And they never was. Uh, my videos, they, it never had that clip. And now I had to go, I have to go in there every fucking day since that fucking bitch did that. I don't want you watching my channel, girl. So get off. Because all you are a thief, I know. She wants to clip so she can go back and remember what I said. That's what she said, you know. And I was like, so, so that's how I know that that girl, whoever she is, I don't know your name and I don't want to fucking know your name. All I know is your stupid comment told what you fucking did. And you and that other, uh, P that I just talked about, the other P, uh, they're the ones that fucked up my channel. That's why upgrades is coming to me, collective, and I'm gonna be able to help you all. I'll give you so much more knowledge, and they're so mad because, see, if you got a clear conscience and a clean heart, then, um, people will trust you, and, and, uh, and, and, they, and they'll know because they'll feel it in your presence, okay? And, but these other people, it says you're a liar and, and you're not a liar and they don't want people trusting you. It's, it's for their own personal, uh, uh, wishes of they're doing that to, because they're scared to bring out what is inside of them. They're just scared. They're a narcissist. That's why she's envious and jealous of me. Are you listening? That's why that Pilly girl is envious and jealous of me and she sp tries to speak bad about me all the time and she does it to Aquarius all the time so if you're all Aquarians and you're doing that she's doing she, and, and you have a channel like me you're all goofy because that woman is uh she's putting you down every time and she acts like you're you know and she does that at least once a week to y'all okay that's what she does because she thinks she's God and there's another reader that wants to be high and mighty and she she does good readings but she needs to learn to quit getting hyper. You can't act hyper and crazy if you're wanting to be high in society, girl. I mean, I'm trying to help you. I'm not helping that other anymore, but I'm trying to help you because you've helped me a lot. But I'll tell you right now, you need to stop popping off like that because that means that you're not healed. And I'm not popping off. I'm telling you the truth, and I, I proved it with my pendulum that doesn't lie. It's a cross, okay? Ain't it funny that cross pulled out and I had just used that? Pay attention now, you guys. Here's how you can believe me. Because here's why. The planets are aligning to bring my collective of twins that believes in this together. Because you had faith in his time. And look at my cross. See my cross. See my cross. Do y'all need another sign? Look. There's my cross. Cross power. Cross powers ignite. It's coming to me. Look. Am I collecting? Zzz, zzz. That ain't against me and uh, stealing from me and trying to do me wrong behind my back. But if you are, I hate to tell you. I hate to tell you because you're next to be blasted out because that's my purpose is to blast these people out. And that's why she's trying to do it to me first. She's trying to do it to me first because she knows good and fucking well I'm the one to do it to her because I'm not scared. And these other readers are. They're scared. But, you know, it's because they don't want to lose their money. And them women, they need to take care of their kids. That woman ain't got no kids to take care of. The daddies take care of them. Okay? Or they're already raised. If, but she's not doing it. Oh, here it is. Oh, it's out. Here's what it said. It said, known around town and Pam and Ask Adam and Clip and Unholy and a Chosen One. What it was saying is, 
That was unholy of you to be asking Adam, asking spirits. That's what she did. She asked spirits about Pam in, around, uh, and asking around town about Pam. That was unholy of you because she's a chosen one, and it pulled out on her name. And me and the divine is wanting you to know for all to see that I was telling the truth about this reader that stuck that is stealing from my collective and my ideas because she clips my videos. But she said I was going to die from cancer and that I had done spells on my children. What a damn liar that you are, you stupid looking woman. I've never done that. I raised my boys and they lived at my home until they were. 18 and 19 they wanted to leave okay they're not here anymore y'all remember i was saying that my boys is back that they, they, they're gone they're gone they know how to take care of themselves they just you know sometimes they have to come back for a week or two and that's okay that's okay but they know where they can come to you see that that's what she's jealous of because she knows the wrong that she's done because she admitted to doing them abortions and you know that's that's you you're the one gonna pay for it one day not me that's why she's uh, challenging God right now. She's challenging God. That's what she's doing. And that's what narcissists do because they think they're God. And, you know, and I can honestly say I challenged God before, but that didn't last too long. After my stepson took a gun and blowed his brains out. And then I got uh, bad on dope and Xanaxes. And then I, I got so bad that I'd had an overdose one day, you all. And I was sitting in a recliner and all of a sudden I... I died. I had died, and I was shooted out the window into a tunnel. It was like a tunnel. It's big around you all. And, and I didn't raise my stepson from birth. No, I didn't. He kind of lived with us. He had only lived our three years, y'all. It's sad. Now, I mean, I had seen him before, but he only lived with us three years. Hang on. <laughs> I got to tell about this. So, anyways, uh, when I shot out that big tunnel it was like tunnel vision you all and all of a sudden i started seeing visions of uh of of alan and when he was a baby and i i didn't even have baby pictures of him you all but like two then uh it's sad but after he died his sister that didn't live with the mommy uh she 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 couldn't get along with none of the daddies she was one of women that always argued and couldn't keep a relationship so they she give her kids away and we get she give us alan and we paid her money we still paid her money and alan was there and she is still drawing food stamps thirty seven twenty seven. i'm telling the truth but anyways, let me finish telling about, uh, so sh the, the sister gave me the pictures is what I'm saying after he died. So I didn't even have these pictures whenever this shit happened. Listen, you all. So I sat there in a recliner and it would have been the same place where my stepson died. And I was sitting back like this, you know what I'm saying? I was sitting back like this and I died. And my husband at day was uh, outside cause he worked eating shift and his cousin was bringing us a load of gravel in a dump truck. So he come up all right day, and I had took a lot of Xanaxes. And uh, because the doctor gave me like four blue ones a day after he died. So anyways, uh, when I went through that tunnel, I started seeing pictures of my stepson when he was little, like visions. And it kept on going. I kept shooting up through there. And I started seeing, well, he was like seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And that's, that's when he died at 17. I start having him visions. And then and then all of a sudden, my husband was like, Pam! And I was like, what are you doing? Why did you wake me up? And I cried. And I challenged God that day. And that's when I challenged God. And I can be honest about it. And I tell you, uh, that's why these narcissists keep doing that. Because they haven't... They, they've challenged God over bad shit they've done. And they're putting blame on God when they need to put blame on theirself. That's how you know they're not healed. That, that plain and simple. That's the story. So she's challenging God because she's too puss to tell her secrets. That's on the inside of her. That's all it is. And seeing I brought it to light just there. That way y'all can know I'm telling the truth. All right. And uh, one of you that's got common sense out here, y'all know I'm telling the truth. But uh, she said that I, she's trying to make me die of colon cancer. Did you hear that? And, and you'll, you'll be going to jail, don't worry. Because she thinks that a law ain't really attached to my channel. And if you're working with a karmic masculine of mine, you know, brother or whoever it is, you dumb 
you're the dumbest bitch I've ever seen because the law, I know them personally. Are you listening? I do. I know them personally. The one law I know, he got shot not long ago here in West Virginia on 79. You can look it up, then you'll know the law's name. Go look it up today, Pilly. I live in West Virginia. Go look it up in uh, in Buchanan. Go look that up. Just, that's how you go type, all right? All right. Just thought I'd help you guys. Oh, yeah, look. Y'all better watch out for all this shit is getting ready to hit the fan. And karma's a real bitch, and it brings about balance. Look here, collective. I love God. Do you all? So if y'all want to talk about... There's that Libra had to come out so, to let y'all know that you're all the one that's in your... You all keep stuck because you're all fearful of telling your secrets, and I'm not. That's why upgrades come to me, and I can tell my collective who the real ones are. And uh, you you need to uh, um, remember, it's one... She's always got her eyes on you all out here. She's got her eyes and ears because uh, I made an oath a long time ago to the divine... To come here this day and age and to warn others that they better clean up their fucking insides and raise the vibes of this planet. And they better start believing that uh, God is real because if you don't, the end of the world's coming. That's what the fuck it means, all right? I'm this person to do that, all right? Yeah, I come from the stars of in heaven up above. Yeah, that's me. That I can tell y'all... That all these challenges, they only make you stronger and wiser in your life. That's what they do, okay? And these ones that uh, think they can go around and act like you, that, uh, that, that they're better and, and trying to make people's minds be open to lies, you're all going down. That's why. That's why I'm the real bitch karma. I'm the karma. I'm the one that come back to do this, okay? I'm yeah, I'm telling you right now, you're a, a militant and relentless predator. You're a cruel bully. You view everybody and everything as a competition. You're always in that fight or flight brain. You're you're you you love to interrogate people. You're a predator. So keep an open mind that I'm telling you that's a reptilian. You go over and listen when she gets real mad, y'all, and listen. I wanted to bring out and prove that I'm not that person. These sons of bitches need to get off my fucking channel. Because all that energy coming over here f from them, and I'm tired of it. That's why this car. That's why I had to do this today, you all. And tomorrow, remember, I'm a shaman, and I can come over there. I can walk between worlds. I just told you, I actually did have a near death experience, you motherfucker. I was dying. I was dead. I was about dead on them Xanaxes. And remember, I told y'all collective that I was going up the road, and my son, he looked like a water. He looked like water. Cri Crinkle water. See how that wings look? That's how he looked crackled. You could see through him, but it was an outline. Do you understand? So, see, I'm one. I can talk about that because uh, my son and, and the angels and, and the divine wanted me to tell this today. And I don't want y'all to get mad. I, I need every one of you all, if you watch it this far, to hit like and share it. Share it with people because they got on my channel, and this is the one that it led back to. This is a true open mind that I'm telling you the truth. And I just proved it. I proved it and I showed you two crosses. And I teach y'all, y'all need to make a vision board and plan out your life the way you want it to look. And it, and look at it daily and it will come to you. Are you listening? And I teach you all that. And I love you and she's mad. I do that to you all. Because she wants you stuck on watching her. And I don't because I need to. I, I, I need you all to have a life, y'all. Y'all need to focus on me like at all time. Because I know that uh, God will bring me who I need. Okay? But, uh, yeah, because I, I, you know, you signed a contract from a long time ago. You're brought here at this time to remember what and why you had to incarnate this lifetime and what you had to fulfill, and that's it. And you're not going to say that you're the bringer of justice, you fucking stupid-ass woman. When you, when you, when you, all you do is go around spitting lies, spitting lies on, about people you know jack shit nothing about. You know jack shit nothing about. So I'm telling you right now, you better stop doing that, all right? And the reason I can talk about you, woman, because I do know what you're about, because you've told it. You've told it on your channel. That you used to do math. And all that. You still do. That's why you don't do readings on the weekend. And I proved it because the pendulum never lies. Trust your pendulum. Trust these. Trust your pendulums. All right. Well, I love you guys. And my readings uh, tell for yourself. And I hope I can help y'all. And tomorrow, I'll be so thankful, God, that this energy, maybe it won't come out. But if it does, you'll know that they're still, they're lost to my channel. And that's why it keeps coming out. Pieces, you guys. I love you.